Tianguan is a heavy self-propelled cut suction dredger built by the Shanghai Zhenhua Industry with a length of 140 meters and a width of 27.8 meters, whose total install power is 25,843 kilowatt. It is a real big guy. However, although the ship is large, the construction process is fast. It only took less than two years to complete and achieve its debut. After completing the mission of the maiden voyage, it was also an important exhibitor of the China Ocean Economy Expo and received great attention from Chinese and foreign media. As China's first heavy-duty self-propelled cut suction dredger with completely independent intellectual property rights from design to construction, Chengkun's operational capabilities are extraordinary. For example, the maximum design road distance is 15 km, and the average daily reclamation of sea sand can reach more than 100,000 cubic meters. At the same time, it is equipped with four different types of rimmers, so it can easily adapt to various geologic environments and it's not a problem to reclaim the sea in the islands. So, it's also called a map editor and an island building artifact. How does Chengkun work? First, it uses the rimmer at the front of the hull to cross the hard rocks and reefs on the sea, then uses a vacuum suction pipe to suck the mud and rocks into the pump and then transport to the designated discharge area for island building. Secondly, the ship is equipped with an intelligent dredging system, which can realize automatic dredging by unmanned control with high operation efficiency and less manpower. In addition, Tianquan can also automatically adjust construction operations according to the underwater environment. So, it's also known as the self-propelled cut suction dredger with the highest level of intelligence in the world, which is evident in its comprehensive performance. But the most important thing is its practical value. Especially in recent years, China's marine economic strategy has been continuously adjusted. In order to speed up the development of the open sea and make better use of marine resources, it is very necessary to develop the Tianquan, a high-efficiency dredging engineering vessel that can adapt to the operating environment of the open sea. In fact, the ship has also made tremendous contributions to China's dredging projects in the open sea. For example, the reclamation of construction of island around several important reefs in the southern waters have taken less than one year and the reclamation area has reached 9 square kilometers, the largest of which is about 2.8 square kilometers. And an airport that large aircraft can take off and land has also been built 